Fisher Girl. Catch the passion. Now with tallow, this is my favorite bait for smallmouth bass. Now this is called a tube jig. And the way this is rigged up is we have a tube jig head and I'm just gonna take it out here. Mm -hmm. That's your tube jig head and it gets inserted into the body of the tube jig. Mm -hmm. And this is how we fish it. Now you can see the hooks exposed there. Now the way you've got it rigged up is great and that's the way it should be for open water when you're fishing away from weeds and down deeper. But we should tell the viewers that you can also rig up a, a tube so that it's really Texas rig or weedless. So what I've got here is a tube, same length, it's three inches, and I've got a small hook. I believe this one is like a number four worm hook. So that's the worm hook that's right here. Now I've uh, put it inside the tube and then it's popped out again. And then I've hooked one side of the tube and out the other. So you can see the hook just on top. So when it's rigged properly, the tube should be straight on the actual hook and there's no additional weight unlike this weighted jig head that's in there. So I can actually take this and cast it out all along the lily pads that are here and some of the other weeds even in shallower water. It's going to have a really slow drop rate and if I just pull it a little bit it'll have a nice action from side to side. So no matter whether you rig it like this Texas rig or you have it on a jig head it works really well especially for bass.